Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome back to my Ruined King. I am recording this on the exact same day as the last session. So, um, if I teeter off in my talkativeness, that's probably why, because I've already been talking for an hour and a half. But, uh, regardless of that, I do hope that you enjoy, and if you like this content, Go ahead and stab the like button. It's the least you can do. It doesn't take all that much time. <coughs> it helps me. It helps you because that means that you have liked videos that are from me, which allows me to be more out there and what have you. Now, uh, we are going to go and do side quests. Uh, we could go do main quests, but I want to go do side quests. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go do side quests. Um, now that the, there, there's people here now, so we can buy shit from them. Well, I suppose we could go talk to this guy over here first, actually. Because he, um, he's like, hey, it is done. You brought everyone back. All my friends to Miss Walker Beams. I cannot tell you how much it means to me. It's been a very long time since I felt real kindness, but you don't want to hear me prattle on the Mythrocker extended his run. Here's your reward. Take the gift. A hardened ring. Oh, I forgot to mention, my name is Phileas. Phileas? Nice to officially meet you, friend. Okay. A ring. What kind of ring? A hardened ring. Stamina. And evade. Um... Here. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll, we'll continue. We'll, we'll we'll leave it. We'll leave everything as it is for the moment. Uh, we're gonna head back to Bilgewater, and well, we could probably. I know we can claim a bounty. We're heading back to Bilgewater. Increasing evade rating. Will increase the chance for your champion to dodge an attack, completely negating damage from it. Yeah. It's pretty useful. The only one who's really good at it, though, is Misfortune. Ari can't... I mean, everyone technically can do it if you give them some equipment that gives them evade, but... Uh, it... Yeah. Anyway. Um, Alright, we did this one. Ooh, I'm gonna need... Um... Yeah, okay. We are gonna go do a quest that is going to require a Lowie. So we are gonna do girl power for a little bit. Granted, that means we're gonna have a lot of healing. Um, I suppose I could probably take off some of the healing things for somebody and go more into the damage for their abilities while we're doing this. Um, uh, yeah, why don't we do that? We'll, we'll keep Guardian Spirit up, but we'll get rid of this and we'll go with increase attack power what does Charm do again? This is a stun, right? A stun, magic sunder, reduce haste. Let's do the stun. We'll, we'll, we'll try to use Charm a bit, because I never really use it. Um, not too terribly worried about Alawi's health, because let's be real. Um, she is an absolute chad. Ugh, this city is such a mess. Um... And we can just heal her up at a later date. Freljord ring. What does that do? Oh, it's level three. Bonus damn. Okay. Hello. Is this what the Freljord is like, Rob? Cozy, everyone friends with each other? Yes. It's a wonderful way to live. 
Rom cannot wait to return. I wonder what it's like growing up that way. Yeah, Fortune didn't have a great home life because her, you know, gangplank killed her parents and what have you. Plus, um, you know, Bilgewater isn't exactly the best place to raise a child. I can't imagine. More things to grab. Little tiny bits of money, but that's okay. Little tiny bits of money are better than no money at all. Hello. Uh, Brewer Feast stops your approach. Truthbearer, you honor us by visiting the Well of the Mother Serpent. I advise caution if visiting, as we have some unwelcome guests currently taking up residence there. At least for the time being, he says. His voice is calm and gentle, though it seems to hide concern. Well of the Mother Serpent. A place of great power that has become a shrine to Nekakoboros, he says. He offers a weak smile. It is a place where captains come to make offerings to avoid ill fortune at sea before they depart. Such is the custom here. Um, unwelcome guests. Oh, well, you see, his eyes vert to the ground. It is nothing, really. It is something that will resolve itself in time, as with all matters. He looks up and gives a con convincing smile. Please do not trouble yourself with it. Priest, as truth bearer, I seek to help my people in any way. Wowie, I knew you would say that, but I was hoping you wouldn't. This is... I'm so sorry that this happened. This is our fault. That's why, he says. Finally, he exhales and relaxes. Whatever you want to call them, road agents, bandits, thugs, they've started harassing visitors to the well. They demand payment just to get to the place of offering. I will settle this matter for you, priest. Thank you. I do not know much more than that. Look for their leader, he says. This well is supposed to be a place of hope and worship. For Palangi and Buru alike, it deeply saddens me to see conflict within it. He nods, completing his thought. Alright, let's go settle this matter. I forgot to start my timer again. That's okay. It's only been a couple minutes, if that. Start the timer. Alright, timer has been started. Hello. You don't, you don't want to talk, okay. That is fine. We will move forward. Um, let me quickly look see. Oh, we missed we missed a reedy reedy do down here somewhere right here. Buru misses. That is a name. That is that is a name. Uh, Osu, Al Osu. The priestess poked me in the belly and told me not to fish in the harbor anymore. Going to try my luck out around the Blade Serpent Reef. Be back late tonight unless my arms give out. You were right, I should have stopped eating those sweet fruits. Ah well, new waters away. Nako. Isulu priestess... Uh, Isulu... Uh, I, I'm so sorry, I cannot pronounce this stuff. That I should build our neighborhood a new ship house. Going to sail over to Turoa to pick up my brothers to help out. I'm thinking we should put a tile pattern floor. Can you design it? So la. Uh, so. I'm not. So. Uh, that's as good as you're gonna get. I'm sorry. I. I wish I could pronounce it, but I, I can't. A truth bearer, a word please. What's up, my dude? Malawi, this is quite an honor. My friend and I come from a small village. He motions to a man sitting nearby. One too small to receive a visit from a truth bearer such as yourself. We are humbled to stand in your presence, he says, and bows his head. We came here to offer tribute to the Mother Serpent. Many speak of this well as a site where Buru and Palangi alike come to worship. I admit we found it hard to believe that Blangy care enough to pay tribute to Nagagaboros. I trust your time in Bilgewater has been illuminating, though it is a city made up of different cultures. There are many who revered the Mother Serpent. Were you able to make an offering to the Mother Serpent? Well, we'll do this one first. Um, we have seen as much ourselves. Perhaps we do not give the Palangi enough credit. Our elders often speak ill of the city, and many wonder why you choose to spend so much time here. The question is such action 
They question if such action would please the Mother Serpent. Bilgewater is a city of motion, a place where many come to pursue their destiny. It is only natural the Mother Serpent would offer her blessing to a place such as this. Sheepishly, he, he shoulders and head lowers. He casts his eyes down allow his feet. You are truly wise, Truthbearer. I look forward to speaking with my elders and telling them of this place. Were you able to offer... Make an offering to the Mother Serpent. No, a group of Pelangi thugs block the path to the bow of the ship and place where I'm told you make offerings. Under the threat of violence, you must pay tribute to them before you can offer one to her. They are stealing her offerings. They put themselves on the same level as the god. Um, I'll put an end to this. I will meet their leader. He smiles. It is good to see you, Olaoya. I will tell my village that I met you. Have fun with that. What is this? Uh... Mosu, Mosu, you have a son now. You cannot go hunting every day. The tides of your life have changed. You must change the pattern. You will come to the temple of the waste tomorrow with your family. Pri Priestess Ethoa. I'm just going to skip the names. I'm not going to skip. The Golai, do you think it is wise for you to go after this Naga cult? The Palangi are fools and easily led by false swerves, but that is not our concern. Let the ocean's clean water wash them away. Salute. Yes, Ialakai, I have many concerns. The dead do not rest well here. The black mist must be drifting nearby. I have ordered the general evacuation back to Buru and Iliti. Ilta. You are part. We are preparing the temples for an assault. I suggest you do the same. High priestess. Oh, this is about the um the temple, the temple that we did a while ago. More reading. I love reading. All right. Uh, thinking of Ilta. No, Nuka. Uh, thanks to your advice and kind words, but I'm not just sick of Bilgewater. The priestesses here are very Meddlesome and bossy. It's almost as bad as when I visited Bura. Of course, I honor Nakaboros, but from Ilta, we take our time there and enjoy life. Change happens as well as a, at a slower and steadier pace, doesn't it? After a hunt, why do I need to rush down, rush down and chop down a tree or mend some nets right after? Can't I rest? And ne when next you summon a great serpent headed toward Ilta, can I ride back with you? They ride on serpents. Big serpents. Uh, what is this? This is a sign. The sign reads, Well, the mother serpent, make ye offering at the bow of the grace for safe passage. Grant mercy for our sins, mother serpent. The sign's gray ink is faded from time and erosion. Hello there. A pair of bandits appear on the path to the bridge and stand in the way. Perhaps... To welcome to the great wishing well. Have you come to make an offering to the mother serpent? For a small fee, we can make your visit here a pleasant one. Are you the people I hear are causing trouble? Trouble? Why, we're of no trouble at all. We're just here to help. We're tour guides. The past, the past this high up can be dangerous. You wouldn't want something terrible to happen to you when trying to make a tribute. Laugh. <laughs> Please, try to take my money. Have it your way, then, he says, grinning. I hope I'm the right level for this. Oh, I'm well above. They will okay. Or they will die. I am well above. No fair. We make it look easy. Yeah, I know. This, this... I will probably not be talking too much during these easy fights, so, um, just so you're aware, I don't really plan on doing that because, let's be real, it's not all that interesting to watch me do quick attacks, and I'll, I might even just cut them out altogether, but that, that, that is to be determined. Um, after all, I am just doing a lot of recording today. In, on this game, because like I said, I, uh, I don't know if it's a couple episodes ago or last episode at this point, because again, I haven't edited it, uh, I do plan on just trying to finish this game before the end of the month. Hey, ducked into an alleyway off Mainspring Crescent. Oh, this is so long. 
Uh, her heart thundering in her chest. Oh, this is a story. The Lusty Legend. Okay, I will actually read it. Um, <laughs> that, that, that speaks ill of me, but... You know, a lusty legend. It's like the Ar the lusty Argonian maid. You have to read it. It's an obligation. Um, not for her close call with the Lux Piltoven Casino security forces, but from the encounter with that mysterious stranger across the card table. Those green eyes hidden behind the ice-feathered mask has blinked amusingly whenever Hayes raised the stakes. Easy to do when playing with a pickpocket purse, of course. And finally, the last time Hayes raised, those red lips had parted with a smile. Or hey. Rather than a stack of chips, the opponent slid a single scrap of paper into the center of the table. Hay was a gambler. She couldn't resist. Call, she said, and the dealer flipped the cards. She'd won, but there was barely a moment to celebrate before the guards were on her. She slipped them, of course, but not without one thing. And with trembling hands, she unfolded a scrap of paper... And at dress in the clan district. Scrawl beneath it, do come. A grin. Are we getting some sexy times on? That would be fun. The door requires a key. Who has the key? Bap! Maybe this will be fun. Okay, we haven't seen these guys. I'm gonna kill them really. Heavy damage over four hits, heavy damage or two hits instantly, only usable when targeting champions. Could I have done this before I had champions? I can see my. More weak enemies for me to kill. We can use this quite yet. No, we need the gunpowder first. All right. Uh, Multi-wave battle. A fight. I, I love getting 6 XP for fights. It's so much fun. Are you having fun, everybody? I say everybody like there's more than one person that's gonna watch this. Maybe in the future, people will come back to the series and be like, Hey, this game looks cool, and watch it. Maybe, I don't know. If you're watching this far in the future, and not just Hurry when... Up. It'll be far in the future when this episode comes out, but like far in the future, like years from now, after it came out. Hi! How you doing? What's it like in 2030? I doubt anybody will watch this in the year of 2030. The year of our Lord 2030. But, um, you know. I would like to do... This one. It's Follow the lights. Aren't you sweet? We walk this path. Gotcha. Someone clean up this mess. Yeah, this um, this is not all that difficult. 
which is fine. I should have come here sooner, but it happens. I this always happens when I play this. I don't think we have anything. Oh, we do. Oh, you carry nothing that the sea wants. I don't have anything actually. Um, I believe this just leads down to the chest down here. I guess we should go do the thingy thing now. Uh, actually, I think that's where we came out of. Actually, need to be up here. I don't even know if you have to fight these guys. I think they might just be cowards. Not actually fight you. They might. I don't really remember. Hello. You must be the leader of this gang. You're the Buru lady. While I respect a clever opportunist, I won't allow this to continue. People should be able to pay respect to Nekrokoboros without influencers. Those who make pilgrimage here don't owe anything to you. Remove your men and or I will remove them. You know I can't do that. If I leave here, I'm as good as dead anyways. I'll give you a choice. Let's see what the mother servant herself thinks of your behavior. A test. And if I fail, you die. What is the test? If you are worthy or not worthy, it's simple. It's the namesake of this place, the test of Nekakoboros. This is the well of the mother serpent, Nekakoboros. You killed my men coming in here, killing me would be easy for you. I don't have a choice, do I? No, you do not. Fine. Now let's get this over with, truth bearer. Stand before me and let your true self be revealed. No, it burns! Ah! Dead. As I thought, unworthy. Anyone else? You work for her, correct? Yes. To steal money from those who seek the praise of the goddess, that is true corruption. Leave here and never return. Mercy, thank you, thank you! Just leave us alone and we'll never set foot here again. Thank you. They are weak and scared. With or without my intervention, they will meet their end. This is where the captain would study the maps if the ship were a seafaring vessel. One day long ago it could have been. Uh, now there is just various weapons, grog, and a large pouch. Inspect the pouch. The pouch is made of tan leather, making it remarkably more durable and even resistant to water. Inside there's a considerable amount of gunpowder. Take the pouch. I now have a pouch of... a bag of gunpowder. Definitely safe to have on you. At all times. Even around fires. Don't have gunpowder around you. I don't know why you'd have gunpowder in the first place, but don't have gunpowder around fires. That would be very irresponsible of you. So the Buru believe that people don't own their souls, right? Indeed. Our souls belong to Mother Kaboros, and she can take them back if we are not using them well. I wonder if she's trying to take mine back. I think you are using yours quite well. So if I remember correctly... There is a bit over here. We can't actually get at it. Hello. You should have left us. More alone. fights. Ooh, that's not hurt. Yeah, that big rock we shoot with the cannon. This is a nice place. A lot of heart. You should be proud, Dilawi. I am. Someday you should come to the Frelio. The Avarosans have excellent hospitality. 
Ah. Uh, a clink of cluttery punctuated the silence of the two women regarding each other. Hay's curiosity at last overcame her stubbornness and she spoke. I don't even know your name. Her companion grinned. Nor do I yours. The green-eyed woman paused and surveyed Hay. Selena. Hey, I suppose we weren't the ones who called... You weren't the ones who called guards on me? Selena shook her head and ruined our game by the gates. No, more wine, my dear. Don't worry, everyone. We will find all of the lusty legend of Hay Haraway.